What's up guys, we're outside here today at East Starland doing an unboxing video for you guys. Let's see what you guys brought in for us today. All right, so we got a pretty big box here. I feel like there could be a console or two inside or it'll just be filled to the top of games. So <laughs> let's see what we could end up with. Let's see what we got. Uh, we got some PS3, some Alice, got some Castlevania collection. Ooh, fancy gold Naruto. Right, let's see what else we have. <laughs> oh man, didn't see that one coming at all. <laughs> okay, kind of blew that profile out of what we just were thinking. Wow, that's Earthbound in the giant box. Oh, you see we got Ness right up in there, in the little eye of the star, man. I never knew that for a long time, never noticed that. But wow, yeah, this one came in a huge box. If you all have not seen this game unboxed, it is quite something special. Oh, they got the guide in there too, yes. Oh, see, one of the awesome things is that it came with this really cool guidebook. And this is very expensive, too. This is at least a few hundred dollars. And that's also pretty funny. Like, you got Ness, and, like, he's just been copied every single way. He's exactly the same in each of those. But this is really cool. And I've only really looked through this, like, maybe once or twice before. Oh, that's sweet. I like the little, like, 3D, like, clay models or whatever these are. The every single enemy. The Runaway 5. Oh, that's awesome. This is really cool. Like, aside from, oh, I love that. Love that part right there. Just in general, this was such a creative game. Really funky. Oh, yeah, we do still have the scratch and sniff. The best part is the scratch and sniff. I'm a little afraid of this. This is definitely a little water damaged. I don't know what I'd be inhaling. I'm just gonna... Oh, yeah, there's something there. <laughs> yeah, you can definitely smell uh, something pungent. I'm not quite sure what that is, but... Yes, that is most certainly, this is certainly it. Oh, look at that, you can put your name on it, little cards. That's so cool, that's awesome. Really, really cool stuff. Love to see it. Anything of the Mother series is just fantastic. I think we got the game itself in here too. Gotta do this a little carefully. I'm pretty sure just the cardboard insert for this itself. Oh, no. <laughs> oh man, look at that. Right across the front. That looks like our copy at home. Look at that. That sucks, but this is still probably at least three or four hundred dollars. At least, maybe even more now. I think trade in value for this in box, I believe it's like around twelve hundred dollars is what we give now. That's insane. I mean, this this would sell for somewhere like that, at least once upon a time. I don't even know. It's been a while. I've been a little bit out of the loop. But I know that the trade in value for this is gonna be unreal. And I'm gonna be, actually, I'm not gonna put this back together now because I'm gonna take my time doing that later after <laughs> that we're done recording for today. So I'm gonna slide that guy aside. Okay, we got Wolfenstein, we got The Darkness, we got some PS3 games, Sing Star, Dante's Inferno, got the Valkyria Chronicles, more 007. Can't believe I never played that one either. Star Wars, Infamous. This is like a full set, a full like PlayStation 3 set of games to, to start with. Not everything's super valuable, but just good solid ps3 games 